know, right? <laughs> I don't like he's yeah. always surprises us. He likes like switching things up a little bit, like not just playing one style of music. Yeah. I don't know, but we are all good as long as y'all are having fun. I'm good. The hashtag is Rock254. Thank you so much for sticking with us. Like I mentioned earlier, we have guests in studio. I told you that, right? Now they are right here. They're not new to the show. Y'all already know about them. They are all about. They're actually kids. We call them kids. They are power slide, aka mm. kids. They are a punk bank, a punk band, <laughs> based in Kenya. Yeah, and they decided to visit us today. I'm just like super excited that y'all are here. So, for anyone who's trying to catch up, can you reintroduce yourself? I'm gonna start with Willie, of yeah. course, and then George. <laughs> well, you've already introduced I know, us. right? But then, <laughs> no, when you're introducing yourself, you always end up like adding a little bit yeah. more. Like, I'm Willie, I do this for the band, yeah. I went to Harvard. Uh, okay. <laughs> no, I'm just saying. Okay, okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm Willie, I'm the guitarist and vocalist for Power Slide. Well, today we're two thirds of Power Slide. We have our drummer Creed, but he couldn't make it. So, it's just George and I. George will take over. Yay. Hi guys, my name is George Zuko. I'm the bassist and thank you for having us. You are always welcome. Like y'all have been here. Like I like when people like uh you know keep their word. Your skills. Yeah, yeah. Remember the last time they were here and then they're yeah. like, Oh, we're working on new music, we're gonna be releasing Easy. it soon. Yeah, so I'm like, oh, you are you guys sure? <laughs> because everybody always says that. Yeah, yeah, we so. know, we know, no, 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 <laughs> so it'll be good new mm, music yeah. and you're here to oh. launch it so we're just like exactly super about, excited like, to yeah. have you guys we're excited and to be here yeah the last time you were here we're still like doing the whole uh, social distancing thing we still do that yeah. but then um back then it was like so serious so mm, thank mm. god like mm. things have actually i don't know <laughs> things so have serious? actually settled down <laughs> just a little bit yeah, yeah the yeah, economy true. has reopened mm -hmm. somehow mm -hmm. people can at least hang out just for but, a while but yeah. yeah we still have curfew but we've come a long way <laughs> so how are you guys doing what have you guys been up to since we last saw you of course since we were here was it a month ago is it two months ago two months ago, two months ago. Yeah. so uh since then we just been working on the new album we just released the first single from the album six days ago on right. days of eternity and uh this is like the debut of our new sound or one of our new sounds we have like so many oh. new sounds now uh -huh. and uh this is this sound is indie G uh, george is a really big indie fan and since yeah. he joined the band we're kind of drifting towards Yo, so y'all are just like experimenting with like uh different sounds on on the album it's got uh 15 songs and each one Ooh. of the songs comes from a different genre or a different subgenre or a different sound mm. you know because rock as um, as a uh, rock just by itself has so many other genres that yeah. have other subgenres mm. it's like a kid who was a kid who was another kid yeah. you know I, I don't know why people generalize rock when people yeah. listen, they they hear rock they think metal yeah. not even knowing like metal itself has mm. other, other like sub other subgenres mm. like this doom this black metal yeah. this like a, this I don't know these are new metal yeah, yeah. so like Grand, people baby industrial baby metal, <laughs> 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 no, baby metal is That's a band a <laughs> <laughs> they are a band <laughs> oh, my bad, my bad. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. they are band but, but, but yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, yeah. The, the first single is indie rock yeah but now the second single is going to be heavy metal Yo! It's actually, uh, this is our poppiest song the next one will be our heaviest song so the whole album is like a very big experiment I am um, so like I don't know what the album is gonna look like, and we have 15 tracks. Who's because are we even tracks. ready? 15 <laughs> yeah, tracks that sound totally ready. different. Bring like the first on. song doesn't sound Bring nothing in the cool. second one. I'm ready. Yeah. Well, I've, yeah. I've already introduced the guys. You see, I just changed the playlist when I changed. <laughs> so by the time the, the, the album will be out, guys will be mentally prepared. Yeah. yeah. Like, what is this the same band? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that is cool. And George, just before COVID, you know, like y'all were supposed to travel out of the country. You had a gig. How's that going? Are you still going to perform? You, you had a tour in Europe. Yeah, we had a tour in Europe. Yeah. But like because of the COVID thing, uh, uh, now we have postponed it. Mm. So I think we'll be going next year. Yeah, we oh, next be going year. In 2020 yeah, 2021, 2021, which is just like so close. Yeah. Just like two months away. Like I know because next month is my birthday. Yeah. Yo, oh, I when's keep your birthday? 
16th like y'all like i don't even know like i just keep saying that just so that people don't be like oh something really really crazy yeah you know a song hollow yeah now that song is about one of my old girlfriends and her birthday is on november 16th (laughs) 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 yo okay okay let let me let me calm down (laughs) 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 you know Okay, let me just calm down. Uh, that, that, that We're going to talk is. after the show because <laughs> but if we talk right now, <laughs> then, like one time I was having an interview on the show, like it's just like um, uh, a band I really, really liked. And then guys are like, yo, Philin, just take some water, you know, like take some water. So I don't want someone telling me to take water right <laughs> now. So, um, you know, I, I want to hear about this song. Uh, what's the name of the single? Like the one you all, uh, Under the Gaze of Eternity, right? Tell me about that. How did that come about? Um, so like uh, we we I came uh, came to Willie's house yeah. and then he told I to, I to, I told him like we should do an indie song and then Willie uh, uh, tried to mix it up tried to create some instrumentals and then like I just had it and I said like this is one of the best indie songs ever like I love the the whole the whole uh, instrumental. And yeah. then we just started experimenting for that. Like, oh. okay, let me, okay. first of all, hold up. Like, you said, like, he created bits for the song? Like, he was the one who was, like, producing bits and stuff? He's the like, one producing. Did you, pr- like, what? Okay, he, mind on, blowing. On this Again. song, He's I produced it and I played all the instruments. Actually, yeah. I was speaking that we met, we were talking about... <laughs> you know? About life after death, <laughs> <laughs> you know? I was just saying like, like, I, I can't, I I can't, can't even. Like, <laughs> you, you know, like when I, was in, when I asked him to introduce himself, that's, those are some of the things I want him to mention. Yeah. Because... Yeah. I'd say I'm a producer so as well, but that's like cheating no, my own I don't see, like that. Like, you should be like, uh, hi, my name is Willie. Like, so, uh, I play guitar. I'm the lead singer of Power Slide. Well, I'm, 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 I'm a producer. <laughs> and, um, oh, I'm also a creative genius because <laughs> of, I have mad skills in Photoshop. This guy can Photoshop like literally anything. <laughs> and I'm not even making that up. Like, that's true. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, what, what, what is this song all about though? Like, um, mm-hmm. the inspiration so, behind it. So, the inspiration behind it was, um, well, the lyrics as well. The, the lyrics just mean that it's a song about non-duality and mm. it talks about how the different sides of life are just all parts of the same core and how all the things we hate in life or all the things we don't want in life are actually the things that make the things that we enjoy a reality because we wouldn't know what dark is if we didn't know what light is. We'd never know what it is to be hungry if we hadn't been full. We wouldn't know what left is without a right. That's actually true, you know. Yeah. Like you, you don't, maybe you don't want a right right now, but then you wouldn't know that you don't want a right if you had never experienced it. Yeah, like, exactly. so, yeah, I totally get that. So it's like, especially now, it's mm-hmm. like um, <laughs> the world seems like it's going to, to a really bad place. And every single time it's like this, there's a new issue coming out. First, we had uh, COVID and then that was like xenophobia everywhere. Yeah. And then we had uh, Black Lives Matter and then we had All Lives Matter and then we had Blue Lives Matter. And now we have <laughs> So it's like we're always Yo. fighting each other. Everyone's like, trying to fight each other. And it's like the US elections. Yeah, exactly. You know, so it's and like, I was actually going to ask about that because I know like um, most punk bands are very political like you all tend to talk about uh, like po- like the bad politics and the policies that are, are being put in place mm-hmm. and right now what's happening in nigeria like the whole of africa there's so many hashtags and mm-hmm. SARS, there's congo is bleeding there's um Missy, in south africa uh, and B- G- gbv there's uh, gender-based violence then there's uh, namibia i don't know what's happening i think like so many girls are getting raped these are they declared a state of emergency because there are so many women that are getting raped and killed Damn. Like it is like really that bad. Like within I think like a month, like a thousand rape cases had been reported. Like a thousand in one state. Like it's really bad. So Namibia. like every country is just like going through a lot. Like a lot. what? Yeah. What's your take on that? Yeah. By the way, uh, I just feel like uh, the world just needs a lot of love. Right. Yeah, and, and that's what we're trying to do with the song. We're trying to have a song that's uniting people yeah. instead of having everyone fight each other. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And also like um, the gender-based violence, also like uh, pro- police brutality. Yeah, mm. like people, especially that. Yeah, yeah, people should talk about it. Yeah. And people should like try to elect people who like can stand up for, for so them. Because when, when, when there's like police brutality, I never see like the, the, the politicians talking about it or saying it's wrong or anything or doing anything about it. So Until like, they're walked with themselves. 
Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so like we should we should pick better leaders. Yeah, I true. Yeah. So. Like so how do we even do that? Like you know, most, most I think like most youth are just like tired. You hear mm-hmm. everybody's like, I'm never gonna vote ever. Like I, I think I in my whole lifetime I've voted vote, once. Honestly. I voted the last election for the first time in my life, <laughs> like ever. But. I feel like um I don't know the do votes even count because like even in this country like there's a lot of corruption mm. so I don't know like w- what do you think like the youth should do because you feel stuck like you're like maybe my one vote won't change anything anyway so do they like still vote do they party how do they even participate in the government they're not even part of like sometimes you feel like even the youth like the you find like um maybe this department is the youth department but the person who is in charge of the youth it's like 17 years you guys you want to talk about youth bro so you <laughs> <laughs> for, for me, I feel like if views count, you yeah. say like likes count, mm-hmm. views count. Why should not your vote count, man? Mm-hmm. Like we should take voting seriously, and it should be like that vote is like a view, it's like a like. Even it's more than a like than a view. Yeah. So like take your take your voting seriously. Right. And I think the youth should get more into politics. Mm. Yeah. You know, yeah. That's a thing. That's a thing. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, that's actually true because like most youth you meet them and they're like, "No, I don't do politics. I'm not mm. interested in politics." But you don't know like every decision of your life is actually governed by that. Like yeah. today the president wakes up and he's like, "Oh, this curfew, this lockdown, you can't go anywhere." He's politically correct. Like you are a YouTuber or whatever you do that you think politics doesn't affect. Your life is actually literally affected by his words. So yeah. I feel like we all like need to take part. However small, mm. the way you've just said, mm. that view that one like, Every it literally counts. 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 Yeah. So I can't wait for you guys to come back when the album is done so that you all can perform for us. Like bring Creed, bring like a drama. Bring, like everyone should just like literally mm-hmm. come through. I said yeah. bling, like oh my God. <laughs> like <laughs> what? <laughs> but, bling, bling. Yeah, you but, know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, like, like, don't even start, ask me. Uh, yeah? We're gonna start chai. playing with an additional guitarist. Yes. So you're gonna be. Oh, oh tell me, the lady though. Like yo. Last week we had a lady guitarist, mind blowing. I was yeah, so excited. Yeah, actually we had Nakasa last week. Nakasa is on this song. Yeah, she told us about that, like, and I'm so so smiling, excited yeah. about that. So when you come next, you all have to perform, like just like perform for us, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah like we'll have like 30 minutes or an hour for you guys to do that. But yeah. for now, maybe your socials so that guys can f- uh, know where to find you on uh, everywhere, like just like all your socials. Yeah. So you can find us on YouTube at Power Slide. You can find us on Facebook at Power Slide. You can find us on Instagram at Power Slide. You can find us on Twitter at Power Slide Band. You can find me on Instagram at Willy underscore Jiro. And G-Man will tell you how to find him you if find he me. wants you to find him. <laughs> <laughs> There's too many like women out there <laughs> looking for him. You know, find him! Find him! Yeah. I wouldn't mind. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you can find me at Instagram at George Zuko. Yeah. Judge Zuku, like the, the service Zuko. provider, Zuku? Oh, Zuko, Zuko. like an avatar. Oh, yeah, like an avatar. Oh, <laughs> got it, a got it. Lord. You know? Yeah. I'm, I'm Fire Lord. I'm the Fire Lord. Ah. Uh, <laughs> like, yo, okay. I'll, I'll say that off, off air. Like, I keep, I, I keep forgetting and then I say so many things I shouldn't be saying. <laughs> anyway, so for the guys at home, if you haven't had this song, she's because you have it, you have it ready? Ah, right there. So our DJ is going to be playing that for us. Keep talking to us. The hashtag is Rock254. We are on Facebook as Y254. We have a post. Go comment below. We take some musical break and we're coming right back. Keep it Y254.